Hello friends, my name is uh, Professor M. S. Rao. I am basically a fitness freak. Unfortunately, I was uh, bedridden due to brain stroke in the year 2021. I am doing physiotherapy exercises for more than a year and I still have to do for one more year to get back to the feet. I was born in a toxic family and grew up in a toxic environment. My life is full of struggles and sufferings. I have mental challenges, financial challenges and physical challenges, but I am not giving up. My right hand was paralyzed. There is no sense to my right hand. Sometimes I am stammering, sometimes I am forgetting. I am using blood thinner to avoid any kind of uh, health uh, challenges in the future and I have to use uh, a blood thinner throughout my life. And nowadays I do physiotherapy exercises two hours in a day. Two hours in a day I go for a walk. Six hours in a day I am sitting with the internet. This is how I am wasting my time. Since my right hand was paralyzed, I am not able to type my right hand, so I am typing with my left hand. So, so many challenges, but I am not giving up. I was uh, lucky to be alive after the brain stroke in the year 2021. My right portion of the body was paralyzed after the brain stroke, but gradually I have recovered and I still have problem with my right leg. And I am not able to work effectively with my right hand currently. So many challenges. I lived in the single bedroom uh, rented a flat for a decade with my wife and two sons who had uh, so many financial challenges. Nobody came forward to support us. On the other hand, my own siblings betrayed. I teach so many challenges in my life. I have other more than 50 books, including the award winning book titled Serial in for which Nobel laureate is always the Lama as it is a poor world. I was a college uh, dropout. At the age of 18, I joined the Indian Air Force and I was lucky that I came out my toxic parents and toxic siblings. At the age of 18, I developed a positive attitude. I started growing as a leader after I joined the Indian Air Force. So I acquired a couple of qualifications after I joined the Indian Air Force. The qualifications include DME, BSc, MBA, MBA, PGD CMM, PGD BM, and end with my PGD soft skills in the year 2011. I am a self made man, no support from anyone. On the other hand, I supported many people. I am 15 years old, still I have financial challenges. I don't get any pension, I don't have any regular income. People think uh, that I acquired qualifications from reputed universities in the world, but the uh, fact is that I was a college dropout. I believed in the philosophy of earning and learning.
Yeah, but I have linked them as been my inspiration since my childhood. I have read thousands of books during my lifetime. I follow the ideals of Mahatma Gandhi. One of the books titled uh, Student Leaders. I have dedicated to Swami Vivekananda on the eve of one fiftieth birthday anniversary. Like this, I have dedicated uh, the books to some of my students and gifted them. I am passionate about education and learning. I want to groom uh, uh, students as global citizens. One of the books titled uh, Strategies to Build Human Leaders. I have dedicated to Maya Angelou, Rosa Parks, Oprah Winfrey, and uh, former Vice President of uh, India, Sri M. Mankan Aydul has written a forward for this book and I advocate the gender equality globally and I have signed up for hashtag T for She. I have written a couple of uh, articles on women empowerment to encourage women and uh, to inspire uh, women leaders globally. <coughs> Thank you for subscribing to my YouTube channel.